Next, we have Yu Chen Zhang with is mandatory quarterly reporting worth it? The three billion dollar question. Everything comes with a cost, but the question is, is it worth it? Think about how we make decisions every day. We weigh up the cost and the benefits on a balanced scale, and then think about whether it is worth it to do it. Now, regulators have a decision to make. They need to decide whether it is worth it to force every company to report on a quarterly basis. What is difficult in this situation is that there is mixed evidence on both sides of the scale so it's very hard to know the outcome. Prior research has shown the benefits of enforcing quarter reporting. More frequent reporting will provide investors with more timely information and also make the firm more transparent. This is protecting and benefiting investors. However, it's also argued that doing so is too costly for firm. According to a survey by Nasdaq, the average cost associated with preparing each quarterly report are $330,000 per quarter. So think about how many companies we have on the entire market. This could be a $3 billion implication every three months. So if you are an investor, would you be willing to let your invested company to pay for that $330,000 for quarterly reports? Hard decision to make, right? And this is exactly what my research is doing. I examine whether the overall cost associated with mandatory quarter reporting outweigh the overall benefits. And I use the change in share price as an indicator of investors' cost benefit trade-off. If investors perceive net benefits, they will react positively, buy more shares, and the share price will be driven up. If investors perceive net cost, they will sell shares and the share price will go down. And I test those change in share price in reaction to a series of events leading to a change of enforcement of quarterly reporting in the UK, either from voluntary to mandatory or from mandatory back to voluntary. And I find that UK investors react negatively to the events leading to the enforcement of quarterly reporting. They also react positively to the first events removing that enforcement. So now we have the result of this balance scale. From UK investors' perspective, the overall cost associated with mandatory cost reporting outweigh the overall benefits. And think again on my research question. Is it worth it to make quarter reporting mandatory? Maybe not. Thank you. <laughs>